The Voice UK host Emma revealed that it has been really different, having previously had a guest spot as a hub presenter on the show. Emma, 42, also works alongside Rylan on Big Brother and gleaned that there were a lot of giggles as the pair reunited for the daytime program. Speaking exclusively to Express.co.uk, Emma smiled, It's been a lot of fun, there's been a lot of giggles. I love Rylan. It's been really different. I haven't done it for such a long time and I've never done it with him, so it's been great. The Voice UK final aired on Saturday night with a win for Sir Tom Jones and 18-year-old Rutio Ladug Bagby. The TV studios at Elstree are just behind the Big Brother and Celebrity Big Brother studios where Emma also takes on hosting duties. Emma revealed that she feels at home as she spends the majority of her year presenting television there. She said, it is home. I spend six months of my year here. It's good, comfortable. I've got a dressing room. And it's my dressing room for Big Brother and The Voice so I feel like it's my little room but I haven't got a plaque on the door. I've just got a piece of cardboard that gets taken off when I leave. It's not really my room. I did walk in this series and they decorated and put some new pictures on the wall which was lovely. Speaking about Jennifer Hudson and Bella Viss's guest of my heart will go on at the weekend. Emma gushed that it was flawless. She said, Jennifer's voice is, in my opinion, the best in the world. So singing with those two girls in the way that they sing is just flawless. Emma revealed that she wasn't able to predict Ruti's win as the acts often hold back during the rehearsals. She said, we did a full dress rehearsal and that's the first time I got to see anything. But you never know. Sometimes in rehearsals they'll hold back or only go 50%, so you never know what's going to come out on the actual night as well. They just take it to a whole new level and bring their A-game 100% to try and get those votes. The presenter also revealed that the show can become emotional at times as they are taken through the ups and downs of the show. Emma continued, My favorite part is the singing. It honestly is. I think especially the audition process when you never know who's going to what they're going to turn for, what type of sound they're looking for. We're literally here in the room watching everything and it's emotional and it's exciting and sometimes it's sad and it's just a whole kind of range of emotions. I think that's the part of it that I love. Then there's the live shows and working with the coaches, the contestants, all of it. There's nothing to not like, really, ask whether she would ever consider auditioning for a singing competition herself? Emma chuckled, absolutely not. My husband says, if I'm singing in the car, which I do sometimes, he kind of looks at me and goes, you are pitch perfect, but tone deaf. If somebody sings a song, you know the pitch there. In, like, you can reach their pitch. But the tone, you have no tone, you cannot sing, you sound like a cat, I'm like, oh, great, thanks, maybe Jay Hud can give me singing lessons, I don't even think somebody that phenomenal could teach me to sing, I'm a lost cause, I promise you, the morning airs weekdays on ITV at 10.30am, The Voice UK is available to watch on the ITV hub.